There's so many teachers I want to thank for encouraging a young girl to continue to push ahead and to make me do well enough to be successful. I was a kid at school who really struggled with the education system, and a lot of it was just way too theoretical for me. But I remember when we did some of those first experiments, and we got these snowberries, peeled the skin off them, put them under a microscope, and there was this whole world going on, which I'd never really accessed before. The Making Science Make Sense program is helping the younger generations to allow science to flourish. Mrs. Colburn was my fourth grade teacher. We did lots of experiments. I can still see her excitement, her pushing us. And as a teacher now, I appreciate that so much. Having some hands-on revelatory experience as a young kid is so important because it gives people the belief that things can happen. Ardell Knutsvig, who was our senior high biology instructor, really brought to life how science is integrated in growing seeds and delivering calves. He had a real way of making science real. My uncle developed a new breed of sheep. I thought this was him having a bit of luck until he showed me one day the breeding plans, the books he had. I thought, wow, that's so cool. I had one teacher, Mr. Drymiller, and he recognized that I wanted to do more and go into engineering. He took it upon himself to come in at seven in the morning and teach us solid analytic geometry and calculus. He said we were going to need those courses, and they weren't offered at our school. I think science is crucial in kids' education. They are the ones that are going to develop the things that we need to feed and sustain the world. Every year, I'm still seeing more benefits of hands-on learning. We need to do that by involving kids. Science isn't something you study, it's something you do. Every day, whether you're a farmer, or you're an engineer, or you're a makeup artist, science is involved in it. I want to thank my uncle. I would like to thank Mrs. Colburn. I want to thank Mr. Dry Miller. I would like to thank Mr. Knutsvig for igniting that spark of curiosity in me and helping me understand how science is involved in everyday life. To learn more and share a thank you, visit saytku.com. I want to thank Mr. Tillak. Thank you, Mr. Risk. I'd like to thank my eighth grade science teacher, Ms. Runge. Thanks, Coach Brandu. Thank you to my childhood ballet teacher, Mrs. Taylor. Thank you to Bears Making Science Make Sense volunteers. Thank you to my dad for all the help through all the years with all of my science projects. I wouldn't have passed science, and I wouldn't be here where I am today if it weren't for him. Thanks, Dad.